Absolutely delighted now to be joined by one of the public lecture givers at this year's uh, conference, uh, Etienne Gis. Etienne is from uh, Lyon University and is a Senelis member. Etienne, welcome. Great, thank you. Thank you very much indeed for taking the time to talk to us today. Thank you. Now, lecture uh, tomorrow about uh, snowflakes. Snowflakes. Why snowflakes? Well, you know, uh, um, a few months ago I was invited to give a lecture for primary school pupils. And it was winter, it was snowing. I said to myself, why not snowflakes? I gave that lecture for little boys and girls and it was a great success. I said to myself, well, what a good idea. Let's discuss snowflakes. So what's so exciting about snowflakes? What's exciting about snowflakes is a mixture of history, mathematics, physics, and more importantly, many questions are still open. So it seemed to me that it might be a good idea to discuss uh, open questions for young people. People in Brazil might not have seen many snowflakes. Most of them won't. And uh, it's, uh, it's terrible news for them because the clouds above us are full of snowflakes and uh, the snowflakes uh, melt before they come to us. So I hope to show them beautiful pictures. So why are you attracted to doing a public lecture, public lectures, where you're not talking to mathematicians at all? You know, this is a very spe specific and very special uh, public lecture because the audience will be basically the winners of the Brazilian Mathematics Olympians. It's a great uh, uh, opportunity for them. Uh, 19 million pupils go to this competition and 500 of them get a gold medal. And as a gift, they are invited to Rio de Janeiro. They come from very far away from places which are very far from Rio de Janeiro. For them, it's a unique opportunity. And they will be invited to the International Congress. And for me, it's a great pleasure to meet pupils. Some of them will become my colleagues in a few years. You're going to be giving this lecture in Portuguese. Sure. Or at least in a version of Portuguese with a French accent. <laughs> Why are you doing that? Why is it important to be able to give this lecture in Portuguese? Well, it seems to me that mathematics is sometimes too far away from society, from the general public. And I, I feel it as my duty. I mean, uh, it's not my choice. I mean, I feel that I have to do what other people did when I was a teenager. So you have a real passion, don't you, for maths and for getting that across to a wider audience? Well, uh, uh, it's, it's, it's an interesting question and it would require more time to answer it. But when I was a kid, um, for me, mathematics was a way of getting my own uh, world uh, away from others. I was shy and disconnected from other people. But today, I think mathematics is much more beautiful when you can share it with others. Well, thank you very much indeed for sharing it with us today. Thank you. And uh, I'm sure the lecture tomorrow will be a great success. Thank you. Thank you. ICM TV is brought to you from the 2018 International Congress of Mathematicians in Brazil. So for more like this, click on some of these great videos and don't forget to subscribe for more from the best in science, from everything from mathematics to physics, geophysics and engineering.